Hello, Ian here with uh, a little demo of controlling the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema, Cinema 4K camera and with the uh, ATEM Mini. Uh, so you'll see that I uh, have here uh, the, the Pocket Camera ATEM Mini and a MIDI device hooked up to my Windows software that's going to control the CCU functions of the camera that you would normally do uh, with the software controls. So you'd, you'd usually try and do this while you're uh, vision mixing. Uh, quite tricky to do with the mouse while paying attention. Uh, so the idea is that you could use this MIDI device to, to uh, do all these adjustments. So uh, I'll just show you uh, the what you actually see on the screen when you when you're doing this with the camera. So I actually have, have the camera here, uh, and me, my picture. Let's use all the features, shall we? And um, so this controls up to four cameras. I've got camera three selected because this camera is connected to input three on the ATEM Mini on this one here. Uh, so even when I uh, switch uh, camera shots, uh, we can still uh, control the camera. So we'll jump back to show you the split screen there. Uh, and as I adjust the gain on the camera, you can possibly just hear the lens clicking. This is a very cheap lens, the cheapest lens I could find that was uh, controllable. It's a 14-42 Lumix lens. Uh, can uh, control the master black level as well. But then what I can do uh, with this top row is control the white balance, uh, saturation, hue, the contrast and I can also change this row from uh, controlling the master black level to the lift gain or uh, gamma color levels. So on this one you'll see uh, the the white balance Oops, white balance for this one so we can change the, the white balance. Get that looking nice. Uh, we can change our saturation see saturation control changing uh, and the contrast but we can also go down here and change from it being uh, the, the master black level. If I switch uh, to this we're now controlling the lift and because we're on camera 3, down here we're on camera 3, all of these uh, will now control uh, RGB values for the lift, so you can see those moving there, and then I can uh, move through to do gamma, which is kind of the mid range uh, or the gain. So quite useful, uh, as well as say contrast. So yeah, plenty of uh, adjustments uh, that we can perform just to adjust the camera nice and quickly without having to try and hold the, mar the uh, mouse down if I want black and white. Oh, contrast, no contrast. saturation. There you go, you get a black and white picture. So that's the uh, pretty much all there is. My next video should hopefully be of the pocket cinema camera CCU being controlled from a normal ATEM, so not via the HDMI cable, uh, but via Bluetooth uh, and 
SDI return feed control with a preview monitor uh, coming from a, a normal ATM as well. 